Alright, hey y'all. So today we're making dry mix. Measuring cup. I'm just gonna use this bowl measuring cup. I'm gonna put it in one of these. Should be enough to fit the. Let me see, five quart bag. Five quart bag. Put it down here. Try not to be too bad because. Okay. What you will need is peanuts, of course. I got the planters honey roasted. Hopefully, you can see that. I'm gonna need two things. So, if you like chocolate like me, two of these MMs. I got the crispy one, which is a milk chocolate bar for my daughter. And I got one for me, which is the crispy one. It's called crispy, and the other one's called peanut. The crispy one for her, which is mixed with Rice crispy treats. Got my silk peanut ones. Okay, we're making two separate bags. Raisins. Got one strawberry and one grape. These are the sour raisin snacks. I tried to find the regular raisins, but I can't find them. Those um, Snickers. Might put like four in there. Just add chocolate flavor. So here we go. Again, honey roasted peanuts. Raisins, Snickers, M&M bar, and then chocolate bar. All right, here we go. So what you want to do is get a spoon. Instead of making two different ones with two different chocolates, first we start off with my daughter's because she's picky. So here we go. Well, she's not picky, but she loves chocolate. Hence why it's a chocolate trail mix. Me and her both love chocolate. Try to get the regular peanuts. Get the, get these for now. It's about a half cup. There's no measurements on this. This is just how I like to do it. I want to use half of the using. Go for it. I'm using the crispy and then bar. That is actually cheaper to make sure mix yourself and flat. So hers is the crispy bar here. I'm gonna break off one bar of the MM. That is a cool little funky dude on there. I should do. So I'm gonna chop uh, not chop them up but break them up. And two bite sized pieces for enjoyment. Plus, choking hazard. Okay. It's gonna start melting. Like I said, I'm making it small. This is hers, and of course, mine's gonna be bigger because I'm an adult. I don't worry about, I don't have to worry about a choking hazard. Hopefully y'all can hear me. Please let me know. I just show you. Um. Do do Here we go. Breaking chocolate bars. I'm only using one half of the bar. Use the other half of it. 
again for hers. About it's about six pieces, I want to say. But here's the other bar. Go back and get it. And this is the same amount for mine. It's a real book. Don't need that much chocolate. So hers, I'm going to put the regular grape raisins. Maybe about three pouches. There's enough chocolate. Yes, it's enough. I like to have it to be honey. That's the eight one. Alright, so this is her trail mix. Hmm. What? This is my daughter. Chocolates, the raisins. Not that I can see that. That's one down. And it's only like, and this is about one measuring cup. It's about half a cup. This is my daughter's. This one's obviously gonna be for me. I have a lot more ingredients. Sandwich bags. There's not in the sandwich bag because it's about two sandwich bags. Sorry, I'm just found them. Another bag. So two. The one is a half cup, so if it's two of these bags, that's more than enough for her. Okay. Go with mine. Like I said, it's my measurements. I don't want to be like the same size amount. I'm adding the peanut butter one. Peanut one. To mine. Y'all see the bar? I'm only using this side. This side flat. Okay. Move over there for later. But now I feel like she needs to, she deserves chocolate. Um I'm going to crack those in. Oh for me, I don't need that. I just break them in. It's big pieces. Size bites. I break them up how you want. But you break up your chocolate. Wanna be fancy? You can cut it. But huh? Not I said the cat. Okay. My hands are washed. Those you might think I didn't wash my hands. I did wash my hands more than most people. I have some sour raisins. I have the watermelon ones for mine. And two bags of these. 
I love love curtains. Peanuts left. So now I'm gonna do <laughs> some for later. But, um, that's mine. And I add two Snicker bars for me. The rest of the stuff I'm gonna put in my spade. Some chocolate peanuts. Snickers. Put them out the bag. I'm going to go back here. I don't need it. I mean, it's extra good. I'm trying to find a smaller bag of Snickers. So I don't need to eat all the chocolate. But you'll get the point. Just a minute. It's the fun side. Of it. Raisins and putting them in the I just don't like boxes. I really just put everything in one bag. Just pull them apart. Pull them apart. Y'all know what to do. If you want to be extra fat, you can heat them up and drizzle them over your trail mix. But anybody got time for that? I'm very basic and simple. Okay. I know Buddy Crocker down the street probably will do that. But uh -uh. not this one. Alright, so that's basic. For mine, I'm just going to stir it up. This is the same stuff, so if I added more chocolate in mine. We have two different flavors of raisins. So that's mine. That's mine. All I'm going to do is both have different things of chocolate and different flavored raisins. Let's add another difference. I'm also going to label these so that means I don't get confused. I'm snacking today. Um, anyway, that's the final result. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's impromptu because I was going to make drum mix today so I was like why not film it. So leave your comments down below and again. Send my squad out.